willing to abandon everything. Abandon everything I've ever done, all connections, all compromises and chest compressions. Watch my lifeline flatline on screen. Drown in heavy lilac air. That last night, before sleep sets in, I remember. I remember all of the men who have broke my breast said, you're one fine girl, woman, bitch, female. I wonder what they will say. If they will objectify me in the same way when body parts dissolve, get put in plastic bags, discarded like a faulty item, like biology made a mistake. We forget about the things we put away. The human memory is forgiving. She lets us construct better things, sort out what has been, so replace what has been sort out the hurt, but my body will always have traces of what I left behind. And I've held a funeral for my body's history, the recollection of the procession of girlhood recollections wrongfully constructed before I had found the words that are hidden beneath the binary my first bra. Hello Kitty, I was barely 11. The clothes I will no longer be able to fill, all the lipstick I started wearing, the lips I've kissed, the soft boy lips, the girl lips with stubble that scratches my cheek in between lips, lips that only existed in empty spaces, all of the mucous membranes that have been penetrated. Snails cry out in shame, leaving glistening highways behind. They've told us we cannot expect society to cater to our genders, but I expect to at least be respected, to not be forced through sterilization as if our kids would be even more confused, more sore thumbs, thumbs more traumatic events, like it is not society that has put us through it in countless interrogations, sterilizations. I'm tired of hearing about siblings getting beat up in the street as if we were punching bags filled with sand. They ask me, what are you, woman, man? Like there could not be other choices, like snails do not exist, like we do not have the words to explain how gender can be so much more than what we asked for. Societies evolve along with the civilizations that carries it, but I think this time humanity might have been too slow. The vocabulary has begun to overflow, growing bodies with it. Is it not a wasted opportunity to not dance with her? Create new polar opposites, combine antonyms and paint pictures right now. We are on different planes of existence. We are like snails, garden pests in your dichotomous green walls. How I love all of my siblings sticking out like sore thumbs in a flat landscape. They ask me, what are you? Man, woman, I say, I am neither. Yeah. <laughs> a nine and a nine point five. Woo! That's a good seven. Total.